Well, joining me live now for more budget wash up, Jennifer Westercott from Business Council of Australia. Uh, you've seen a few of these come and go before. What's your take, first of all, on what we saw yesterday? I think it's a pretty solid for the circumstances we find ourselves in. I think the missed opportunity, though, is to do something about our productivity and our investment, which would lead to higher growth, more sustainable budgets, better wages, and so on. On the plus side, obviously, getting back into surplus is good, give markets confidence. Um, but it's driven by those higher company taxes, those higher personal taxes, driven off strong labour market, commodity prices. You've got some good stuff on growth, energy, skills, migration. You've got some important cost of living relief, job seeker, rent assistance, very good stuff on Medicare, reinvigorating the Medicare system. Mm. The risk for us, though, Tom, is that you've put big structural spends in off the back of temporary and often volatile revenue increases and against the backdrop of a feeble, dismal 1.5% economic growth rate. And that's where we've got to put all the effort now. Drive productivity, drive mm. investment, get growth up, because that's the way to sustainable surpluses and that's the way to higher wages, better living standards. 1.5% next year, it could be 1% with financial stress around the yeah, world. Exactly. Uh, it will be a real per capita recession if you look at population yep. growth. So on the productivity side, I guess the government would argue... Um, there's plenty in the energy sector. Mm. Uh, they've looked at supply chains a lot and, and made investments there. There's a lot around investment, TAFE and university places yep. as well. What's missing specifically you wanted to see? Well, the, so all those things are good and we've been complimentary about that and been big supporters of the, particularly the skill stuff, which is excellent. You've got to, of course, target those free places to where the skill gaps are. What, where, what I think is missing is the investment stuff. I mean, business investment is still as low as it was in the 1990s. We've got more money leaving the country than coming in. You've got the Inflation Reduction Act in the United States sucking investment out, making those hydrogen projects, those critical minerals projects, more effective to do in the United States than here. You've got complex uh, verb restrictions. You've got you know, a regulatory environment that's still way too... So a lot of areas that might not have even needed big spends necessarily. Exactly. exactly. You don't so need on. to spend a lot. You um, need to do the, do the work. 